as we're continuing to talk to some great folks here at the Kitchen and Bath Show, I was really amazed at what's going on uh, in the intuitive cabinets and cupboards. Um, well, wait to hear about it. I mean, it is involving LED lights, and it's involving the way that these are almost motorized. So we welcome in now a great guy who's going to talk about it, uh, Jake Van Wyk with Hayfell. Hefela. 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 I'll get it right. Hefela, which is H A F E L E. With right? an umlaut with over the A. Yeah, Hefela. <laughs> now, and these folks aren't from Germany by chance. Of course, right? they okay. are. It's hardware, right? I know. <laughs> but you know what's funny is that, that Jake used to work with Haynes. That's right. And tell, tell Eric Wait, your the little panties, line. The panties? Well, he was marketing for Haynes doing what? Uh, underwear, schlepping underwear. And now he's working with? Hefela. Slipping hardware. Hardware. <laughs> and actually, in between, I work for a software company. Uh, so He's so, got all the wares covered. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if you can wear weird. it, I can do it. Oh, I love it, Jake. So, Jake, I mean, paint a picture for folks, because when you look at these different really smart and interactive and innovative cabinets and cupboards, I mean, there, there's motion. There's things going on. That's right. Well, it's designed to work for you instead of you working for your space or your kitchen. So that's what we're passionate about is yeah. making uh, – Helping people be able to live effectively, efficiently in their space, make their kitchen space work for them. So, for instance, underneath the ca- uh, the countertop, there was this this cabinet, and it had like a sliding door, but it pulled out a little bit and then over, right? Describe how that's that, right. And uh, soft touch. Yeah, sure. That's our our, our Frontino sliding uh, cabinet door software or soft. Yeah, there I'm back on my I, software. I, that's okay. We get where, to. Where, <laughs> My ca- uh, sliding cabinet hardware. and uh, Just don't bring underpants in that conversation. <laughs> anyway, go ahead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think he's blushing. Anyway, but, uh, it, you know, sliding is such an obvious thing because it right. doesn't slide out. So right. it, it makes things so much uh, much more efficient. So wait, space. so wait. In the, in the cabinet, the, the, thing, the shelf comes out and then moves Toward you. away and then to, to the, the right. Side. Yeah. Right. To the side. Wow. So there's no tracks. And I don't know about you, but when I used to think of sliding, I thought of my old sliding doors that you know, and then comes off the tracks. Yeah. Or, you know, like, like that. And then it activates an LED light inside Absolutely. so that you can see all of your spices and canned goods and pots right. and whatever. Right. And and, and they are touched so you can you know, barely Lightly. pull it, and it just slides, and it's soft clothes, all these things that is just, you know, again, very smart, very, very smooth. Very innovative. And, you know, a lot of technology goes into it. Uh, you know, people don't really realize the role of hardware technology in making, you know, in kitchen cabinets and, and really making your life well, easier. Well, here's what I what it is to me, because, I you know, I've installed cabinets for years in my life as a mm-hmm. contractor. Basically... It it creates the look the the feel and the experience of the of the cabinetry. So you're going to generally have a, a cabinet face and it looks beautiful. But if the operation is terrible, then it feels cheap and and it doesn't feel like something you paid for. Absolutely. You know what I mean? It doesn't feel worth it. That's right. So when those hinges or the sliders or whatever technology it is work effectively and there's a soft close element, you really feel like you got something that you paid it's, for. It's a very rich feeling. Yeah, you know? it really is. And I'll talk about some of the ergonomic elements, too. So for someone who was either short or mm-hmm. had some kind of an injury or disability and you had to reach up, because we all have to reach up to get those certain things, talk about what your solution is for that. Oh, sure. We've got uh, you know, cabinets where you can grab a handle and then pull down. Down and your shelves come down to you. That's, come on. that's the motorized part. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. You can either do it motorized really? or there even oh, with a handle. Yeah. You know, and, and, you know, and with you know so, use so, of hydraulics so and all those. For those. example, yeah. you're you're someone that's older or impaired a bit. You just grab it. short. It just comes out. <laughs> you can't reach it. To you. <laughs> And, and, and exactly. This is so unfair. And then the lazy Susan with the lazy well, Susan and let me was tell really you, cool. But you don't even have to be short. No, you don't. Because think about it, half our kitchens aren't even usable. You know, well, all I have on my top counters because I don't have all yeah, this yeah, equipment yeah. here. We don't have space. It's all my old wedding gifts that oh, we don't get up there. Oh yeah, gosh. Because who can get up there? And so now this makes your whole kitchen accessible to yeah. you. That's what I'm talking about. Making your kitchen work for you as yeah. opposed to you know just this part. It's a great that's, idea. Uh, and I love to we'll talk about this lazy Susan though. It is your everyday lazy susan i mean it was mammoth and you could put these major serving buffet plates and sure things that, in there. yeah it's our lamont it, unit it so it goes out. all the way out into it pulls all the way out fold it comes like out an so S you, pattern and then you've got basically a tray in front of you of your whole uh, everything you had in your counter so you can use your whole space in there so and of course the is, lights come on when you open yeah. the door and is that how you guys dealt with the dead corner absolutely it's, oh my god for those I large just, items can, yeah if you guys can see i'm holding him in my arms right now and i'm oh. 
Because the dead corner it's the hay full of love. in cabinetry. <laughs> there is a lot of love for hay full of love. You know what I mean? Well, Jake, tell people the website. And uh, I know that you love that it's a tricky name to say because you, th- you said it'll make us remember what hay full of is. But what is the website? It is hayfula.com, H A. F E L E dot com. Okay. And uh, and for the U S. Of course, it's slash U S. Because we're a global company. We yeah. we're all over the world because we're scouring the world for finding these solutions for people. That's great. And, Very creative. Thank it. you so much, uh, Jake Van Wyck uh, with Hayfula for sharing all the new things you're finding, and I'm sure there'll be more coming up the, around the bend. Right. That's right. All right. Always looking for new stuff. For all you. right. Well, coming up, we're going to take our experience in the kitchen to the outside. Uh, you like to grill. Don't you, Eric Stromer? Love, love, love. Wait to hear about this grill that is on steroids. You can cook it three ways all at once. No. (laughs) It's coming up next as the fun continues. Home Wizards, we are here at the greatest kitchen and bath trade show on the planet uh, here in Chicago, and we're going to bring more of the neat finds that you're going to be wanting to dream about. Can't wait, yeah. Eric Stromer, Cindy Dole. The fun continues after this. Yeah. 